You can easily remove the birth date or anniversaries from contacts by using a group by view for the birthday and anniversary fields. First we need to add the fields to our view and it's easier if you put them at the beginning of the view and then we're going to group by the field. We'll remove the fields we don't want to group by to make it easier and we'll go down to the bottom where we find the none field and we'll drag items to it and this will change them all to have the anniversary of none. You can select all and drag the entire group to the none group and it will change all of them at once. Now we need to repeat this for the birthday field. We'll group by the birthday field, remove the anniversary field. Now we'll need to find a contact with the none field. We're going to collapse all the groups to make it easier this time and you can drag the groups to the none group. We're going to use shift click to select that group and we're going to drag the uh, rest of them so all of the birthdays are in the none group. When the birthdays are still linked to the calendar event outlook we'll delete them when you change the birthday or anniversary date to none. If not you'll need to go into the calendar to see if they were deleted. Now we're going to check and see if all of the birthday events were removed from the calendar. We go into the calendar and type birthday or anniversary in the search field and this will bring up all the items and again we, we can use shift click to select an entire group and delete it.